actually recording i'll send you okay today i'll get tomorrow. yes i i have actually received it so not an issue so you okay. don't need to send okay. so i already got it and i've started okay. the recording you can go ahead yeah okay uh let me present my screen uh sure till that time can you guys please confirm that you all have received the uh meeting invites for all the days right yes 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 okay so there was one more person washik who was supposed kishor, to join kishor. but that person is not joining kishor 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 is not join i i think yeah so he would be joining or not Hi. Actually, yesterday he told, he told me he was leave yesterday. Okay, I don't know. I'll I let me ping in the group once again, and I what his sure. option I don't know. Okay, just ping in the group. Okay, okay. Okay. So you can take it forward from now. I might drop it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Not an issue. Yeah. Ah, uh, please confirm my screen is visible or not. That is yes. visible. Yes. Okay. So, uh, whatever we have discussed yes yesterday, that everything is clear, right? And now, uh, I am again going to discuss this thing virtual dom. Okay. I think. This is not uh, very much clear over there. Again, I am just discussing this thing. Okay. Please, Gosh, uh, presenting a PPT, then the PPT is not visible. Not visible. PPT is not visible. What I have shared my screen. One minute. The window tab is visible, like your Google Meet is visible, but not the PPT. So when you are sharing, you need to select the window you want to share. Well, My screen is visible. Can you please uh, anybody confirm? Have you? Yes. Now yes, it's yes, sir. Have you seen my PPT? Yes. Okay. Uh, again, uh, I'll going to discuss the virtual DOM and. Do you have any questions, guys, on the virtual DOM? But uh, then otherwise, I can understand that the, how much you get the understanding of the virtual DOM. Hello? Hello? Am I audible? Yes. So, have all you understood, right? About the virtual dom. Hello. Yes, sir. Okay. So once again, I just tell, uh, just discuss that the every component here uh, working as a node. And this node, we have re-rendered when it goes to the browser DOM, okay? So there are so many components. And any component has changed. The change effect re-rendered and goes to the browser. 
did it clean uh, excuse me uh, sir i thought your voice is breaking actually what about you has to be the true voice actually yeah, sir your voice is breaking i cannot voice? listen you properly no hello hello am i audible yes yes sir uh, so whatever i discussed that at the virtual dom whatever component you have rendered in the react is directly not goes to the dom through uh, and it goes to first virtual dom or shadow dom there it has to be re-rendered and then it goes to dom so what you can see that difference right what the difference is there any component change some difference will be might be affected and then is re-rendered and goes to the dom this is the concept of virtual dom which i have discussed yesterday okay the next slide is concept of jsx so jsx is stand for javascript xml and today i have gone every uh, uh, your whatever i have discussed that demo also be there okay so first discuss the jsx part and then i will go in the code and i will see what is jsx and how it works inside the code okay so you see the pipeline pictures right user user has written some code and in inside the react component it might be functional or state in the component he has writing some code so their trans compiler is there means compilation the types keep to js because in the browser browser only understand the html css and javascript otherwise browser cannot understand your type script code okay TypeScript only written and pre-compiled inside the React component. So whatever code you have written through the TypeScript, that only understood by, by the React component itself or React. React framework or React library itself is it does not understand. Variable, you have to convert into the JavaScript. So, what screen uh, this value variable name and assign some value, and then it goes to the browser. This is the JSX concept. Okay. Now I'm going to. Uh, uh, this is my my Visual Studio code is uh, visible, right? Uh, yes. 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 Hello. Yes, coach. So uh, here you can see a couple of components I've written. For first, I'm going to the this one. You also can start, okay, in your side. Now uh, I've added this. This is the functional component, okay. So in the functional component, we have some import React JS React library. This is the React library. We have uh, we have to import first React. After that, I have to write this function name. Okay. And when inside the function, we have some return. Return means it will return some objects, some JSX. So you can see that this is some different type of code. And this is the HTML code. Okay. So both are compiled inside one platform. This is called JSX. Okay, XML, JavaScript, and HTML. Any language or any tag is accepted over here. And this tag, when you write npm run build or ng build, it has to be compiled into the JavaScript code. This is called JSX. Okay. So have you tried this guy? Uh, this thing as in your code base? Hello. Uh, no go. Hello. I can't try.
Hello. So your React installation is done. Uh, I'm asking that your React installation is done. Hi, yes, yes. Hello. Hi, yes, Koshi. Yes. Uh, Hello, Koshi. Uh, so today, um, uh, just do one. Yes. I'm facing some issue. Can I share my screen? Uh, can you please? Yes, yes, obviously. You can you can share the screen, then we can discuss, okay? Yeah. Some activities we have to do, okay? Side by side, because we have some less timing, like one hour we have to do some discussion. Along with that, we have to do with some activities. Otherwise, we cannot afford, okay? See. When I'm using this command, uh, and, ah, so uh, React, and tab, React tab is already installed. Okay. Yeah. And second command when we run means uh, we create an app, React app, create React so, app. Uh, and uh, how name, many? Like uh, okay, okay. So I have to understand that uh, it says something. Everybody's React is up and running. Except everybody is reacting. Is but, uh, I have one query in your local system. I just want to understand. Uh, my files are not safe, yes. but uh, my files are not safe. Your code is not but, up and running. Uh, React application is running properly. Okay. But files are not saved in Visual Source Code. Okay, so uh, one minute. I go to Cypher. Cypher, can you do one thing? Yes. Instead of writing this command, okay, inside the mm -hmm. terminal, try to execute in the command prompt. Okay. Same same thing here. The same issue I'm facing. Same issue, issue. And you just told me that inside this folder, your code base is there. Where is your code base? Means uh, your React, uh, some folder you have created, right? Before going to execute this command. So where you have created? No, you have not created anything. Do one thing, create the folder once, okay? Not an issue. React project. React project, okay. Okay. Open Go it. to this comment. Yes. Let's see. Open it. CMD and now create reactive test because create reactive is globally and uh, let uh, please be assured that you have added the G command right when no 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 it has to be installed it has installed because this is you just comment uh, add this comment create reactive test okay. Okay, can I enter? Hello? Koshi? Hello? React REACT is okay. Sorry? React create React app test. Create uh, React app test. Test? Yeah, test. Whatever name you can go. Okay, I'm giving test this project. Is, this is, I'm yes, giving this is your project, project folder. This is your project folder. Any name you want, you can write. Okay, I'm entering. Yes. That means React tab not recognized, right? Yes. Uh, do do one thing. Create re npm install. This command you again add. npm install. What are the first first line of your in the no notepad? Whatever the command I have given now in the notepad, this command you have to add. Yes, yes. 
I think he was telling his incorrect create reactor. Ah, yes, that also will be for the react app spelling is problem. C-R-E-A-T. R-E-A-C-T. React. 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 Not E. React. React. Okay. Okay. One second. E. React spelling, create React app. This E we have to add it. Okay. That is C. This should not be added. React hyphen app. Yes. Now yes. R E S T T React app. Now you can. Uh, okay. okay. Uh, can you please write node version? I want to see which version is you are working. Node hyphen hyphen version. Okay, enter. 12. And the current React is, I think, 17, right? 16.5. Yeah. Six, uh, so it requires node version, node, higher node version. Let us That's why uh, you have to upgrade your node with the help of IT guys. Okay. Do one thing, go to the ID, online ID, okay? No, no, here you cannot do anything because node you have to update. Otherwise, this command will not be work. Again, we, we raise the ticket. Uh, yes, yes, we raise the ticket. Instead of that, you can go currently in the your uh, online ID and rest of the topic I can discuss over there. Okay. Okay, okay. okay. Otherwise, the to list we have okay. So one second, one second. Uh, I already installed, downloaded. Uh, node is sixteen point fourteen point two. You okay. all. Uh, yes. Yes, yes. Go to the online ID. Uh, but you you, uh, you cannot install it. node 14 i think that 14.18.3 i think this is the version uh, that is a required or 16 uh, upgrade version is also be there okay so we can use this version yes okay okay hmm so uh, currently you can go in the tab in the online id online id then you can start okay okay so first i am uh, uh, just giving one task everybody can do this thing create one normal uh, like any uh, tag like welcome hello world this kind of text you can write in the component okay and render Okay, I will stop my sharing. Hmm. You can share, okay, not a problem, but I suggest that after this session or in the morning time we can discuss, okay? That will be the problem is coming, I understood, that has to be resolved. But I have to complete the topic also, na? Okay, you can share, not an issue. Just share your screen. Yes. When I click on this save all, 
it's showing me like that actually mm. uh, this error is coming okay write the h1 tag again even write the h1 tag again yeah. A tag is mismatch. But uh, no. if I uh, control it, uh, what? No app. Where? What is the app dot js? Can you see what is the app dot js? What you've written yes, in the app dot js? Yes, it is showing that. It's showing. Go to the app dot js. When I control Z, everything is splitting. Yes, okay. uh, when, when I you write, save when you the save, right? File. I mean, your settings. But it is save, showing save, 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 now save. I click on save all, it's showing like that. See, that means okay. some uh, setting problem. It's not a, uh, you have some settings problem. Go to any settings tab, file, setting. Yes, yes, go to the auto uh, on size tab size scroll down. Actually, support auto closing and tab. Mm. I didn't see this type of error. Uh, uh, font formatting suggestion workbench. Go to application. No, cursor font formatting diff mean tiger. Yes. No, go to security. Uh, security name of application first time any means uh, when you install after that this problem is coming right Can you press Ctrl C P one second? Ctrl C P. Comment. Shift. Uh, go to Ctrl C P. Right. Uh, go to settings. Ctrl C P. Okay, do only. Uh, just open the online agent. After the call, okay. I'll I can discuss with you because the time is so less. We cannot debug this time. Okay. Okay. Any problem if you face, we cannot discuss at it in that in that session time. Okay. Otherwise, we ca I cannot uh, complete the session. Whatever I have target to complete. Okay. 
so those are okay. facing these issues not working please go to the online editor everybody okay And perhaps Lisa, can you please share your skin? I just do. One thing. Means uh, the command, uh, whatever we can discuss that we have to integrate it yourself. Okay. So one editor or one screen setting I require. Whatever I did, uh, I will tell that you can all follow. Okay. One screen is required. So, so, yes. Go. I'm trying to try to uh, do the setup of the that is test. No, no, do don't the, don't do the test right now. I am just telling. Go to the app dot I already removed all these things. Ah, just, just remove this one. And this thing create one app app. Don't go app.js uh, app.ts we are working only the js file first okay testing session is separately i can discuss all the things so this is your function app okay so everybody go to their online editor and then you can write this okay Run, run this, run this one. This one, are you sync with our NPM start, no? uh, session? Sorry, that is an asking on the cycle. Where are you doing the session? Mm -hmm. No, Koshik. Actually, uh, we are starting the command from uh, NPM start. And after that, uh, doing the code in index.js. Uh, so this line you can go over there. Okay, after installing your app, just mm -hmm. write the write go to the app.js and write some things over there. These are first hand uh, answer. Okay. Uh, Koshik, uh, one thing. Uh, which file uh, yes. we have used to index.js or app.js uh, coding? Can you can you skip, can you share your skin? After that, everybody are in the same platform. Then we can start. Okay, otherwise some problem might be happened. Okay. okay, so can you please share your skin? Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Yes, yes. Yeah, I already uh, create a component uh, directory and inside that I create an app uh, directory and all the app.css and JS. No, no, uh, remove, remove this one. Remove app. component. Re remove. I am telling the remove component all and all the things only after I have share my screen. So in the react yes already there. Ah, yes. This is your first, yes. Uh, so go to the app dot yes. Okay, remove everything in the header. Only write only one D should be there. Okay, remove header. This remove seven header. number line to twenty number line. Total you have to remove. Okay, uh, write some tag. 
P tag, span tag, any tag you can add. Okay, write some name. Okay. And run this code and then go to your index.js. Go to index.js. Actually, uh, remove this one. Re remove this one and okay. import app. 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 Yes. Uh, no, no. Actually, I forget this command. App.js. Uh, no, 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 app, no, no. Only app. Only app. Right? Only app. Only app. Okay. And uh, actually, uh, my screen is uh, visible. With the tag. The yes. 300. So, uh, after refresh, please. I'm adding the so, tag name. Okay, with the tag. Follow okay. the stage. Not that. I'm going to still in the tag. Okay. I have seen one page in the chat. I have Hello, sent sorry. one text. Follow this one. Hello. I have sent one text in the chat. Ah, yes. Copy that, paste there, run the comment. You can see. Okay. okay, okay. And app should be yes. in the capital. A should be capital. Yes. yes. Run this comment. Uh, can I run the directly or? Uh, yes, 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 yes. You will read in read in. Now you can see, hello world is yes. coming from app.js, right? Yes. So that means you have imported successfully your app folder, app.js comment inside your mm -hmm. index.js. So index.js here is a entry point is a entry point page okay js file okay so whenever or, you are installed plan ask for app.js uh, yes, yes. okay and you can hello sir app.js is a you can Called this hub component, okay. You can create multiple things over there, okay. Yes, yes. Hello, sir. Yes, I yes, want to do something. Yes, can I share my screen? Yes. Are you able to see my screen? Yeah, I just uh, yes. remove the all the codes from uh, in app.js. And put a span tag and uh, yes. put a uh, text app components. Mm -hmm. And uh, yes. I used yes. uh, app is inside the uh, index. Yes, page. yes, yes. Anything yes. else? No, no, no. no but I'm no. getting Only a warning error. Warning node. Logo. <laughs> is imported over there, right? In the app. Yeah. Go to the app.js. In the app.js, logo is, is imported but not used. That in the logo. Okay, import logo from logo.svg, right? Yes. That, that means logo is inactive. 
we have used but it does not any use case just mention and un, un, undefined value is not there okay? okay now you can see there is no error in the page right yes you can add this one so guys everybody are in the same position or anybody have some problem can you please confirm this thing my side is done uh Koshik. Uh, okay. Word is center. Kushik, I write the code, but uh, can't save that. Why? No, no, no. You can go in the online region. Na? I told you this. This fix I have done after the after the session. Okay. Go to your online editor. Mm, I have link, but uh, where to go? I don't know. Can I share the screen? Hello. Hello. Sharing the screen? Yes, uh, it's showing like that. This page. Where to go? Can you share? Then I can send. I shared. Online editor. Yes, yes. Uh, go to the news and react, react, react. This one, this, this one, react. Yes. Yes. Click that one. This page is opening, okay? okay? This is the first page. So you can uh, remove the comment, you can write by yourself also. Export default or function. Remove this one. No, all line. Except the third, third form, third. Number line to end number line. From third to ten. Yes. Remove this one. Write normal function. Assume that you are writing in the JavaScript. Okay. Remove everything you can remove. Okay. Write function. Write function. Where you copy? Copy here, you can get. And the normal function you're reading angular just right. The same thing you write. There is no extra extra thing you're doing. Okay. Don't go, don't, don't, don't go there. Don't copy and don't go there. Okay, whatever I do. Yes, curly braces. Enter. Okay. Now return. Back it. Mm, first return first brackets don't see the error return for now div only return return then div or string anything you can write okay First, first uh, return normal string, a normal string, welcome. Remove the H1. Yes. Inside the, uh, some strings tag, right? Inside the curly braces, curly braces. Inside the curly braces. Dot, put, no, no. 
like this. Oh, this one. No, 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 this string, 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 string comment you have No. Okay. Inside this, uh, double this one you can do the double course. Yes, go to the. Okay. Now export export default app. La no, no, Can last line. Six. No, no, after six number line. App. Okay, done. So your, your first screen is ready, right? Okay, welcome is coming. No, no, do anything over there on the app. Refresh. Single string, I think the single. Uh, Quotation you have to write at single code, not the double code. Uh, warning the tag welcome is in recognized in the browser if you meant to render a React component. Start this name with an new uppercase letter right click. Welcome is the in the browser if you mean React component start with name. No. Uh, uppercase letter. Yes. Write some tag, write some tag over there. No, no, HTML tag, H1 tag. Okay. H1 complete and remove the string, okay? Showing okay. error. So now back it return back it return back it as the get complete the back it for building component class function for composite. Export default. You have input React, otherwise, how it will be understood? Input React, React, React. Input React. React from React. Like this. Input React from React. Can you write function once again in the return? Okay. Some color I have showing some change colors. Uh, yes, yes. Remove this one. Remove this one. Back it. First back it. 
so uh, now you have to create one component okay in the folder okay create one folder hello these are
create one folder yeah create one folder inside the application source मैंने बनाया एक मेन मेन जीएस फाइल ओके यस एक्सपोर्ट मैंने कर दिया फंक्शन को यस यस जैसे आप अभी बता रहे थे हम्म रिटर्न मैं करा रहा हूं एच2 yes. में एक कोई कंटेंट डाल दिया टेक्स्ट 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 डाल दिया राइट अब मैं इसको यहां पे इंपोर्ट कर रहा हूं तो ये इंपोर्ट इंपोर्ट मेन इंपोर्ट मेन फ्रॉम मेन मेन इज योर इंपोर्ट मेन राइट इंपोर्ट मेन main from from main space dot 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 slash dot slash dot slash dot slash main okay, okay. now you can okay. see it will come okay save save it save that reload the page yeah, reload the page I got it. You have to wait some. Ah, yeah. Main content, yes. Okay, so yes. this is your another folder, another file, main dot js. Okay. Okay. You have to import this one. So React basically works as a building block component. You have to create the component. Inside the component, you have to add uh, your code, whatever your text. Then you have to import this one, right? Yes. So main you have imported. So your main command is coming. Okay. Okay. So this is a JSX. Whatever you have written, this is called JSX. Okay. Means here JSX. J J S X. JavaScript and XML. JSX. Okay. This XML is different, different now. Huh? Yes. What? XML is like different now. वो तो खुद का tag बनाता है ना. JavaScript and HTML you can. रिटेन इन ओके ओके कंपाइलर ओके जैसे हम लोगों ने मेन नाम का एक टैग बना दिया आप आप अभी आप अभी टेक वन वेरिएबल राइट हेलो कोड सैंडबॉक्स राइट टेक वन वेरिएबल बी आफ्टर द लाइन नंबर 3 टेक वन वेरिएबल वार टेक वन वेरिएबल इनसाइड अ रिटर्न या आउटसाइड अ बिफोर 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 आफ्टर द लाइन नंबर 3 ओके टेक वन वेरिएबल कुछ भी नाम दीजिए रिमूव द टेक्स कोर्स एंड बॉक्स कार्लि ब्रेसेस कार्लि ब्रेस एट टेम Mm, only one, only one. Team. Okay. Aya X Y Z. That means you have written HTML along with JavaScript at the same place. This so is called JSX. You can find the property, right? Yes. You can create one object. Everybody, can you try this one? Everybody. Uh, this create one object like var tame create one object from the object you can uh, add one property it will be rendered over there so this is called jsx okay this is called template string compilation this is me this method is called string compilation you have to compile your string you can take any variable you can Uh, take any number. We can take any variable and at the same time uh, we can bind this variable in the. Uh, yes, 
yes you can take any variable any string format any number any object you can concatenate over there right this method this this is called your uh, javascript and xml uh, html jsx syntax jsx concept okay okay so everybody are uh, done this thing please uh, if not then uh, then do create one component in the folder and from the folder you can import this one okay this component you have to create this is a building block component this is your folder okay, okay. tomorrow you have to do every i am giving you a task uh, uh, just one web page like header footer side nav and main content create four component and inside the app js render them this is okay. your task okay create some okay. logos create some navigation otherwise you cannot understood right so how component will work okay header component you have to create sidebar component you have to create nav component create and do this thing. i will share some html code okay in the in our group hard coded html you have to split into component this is your task for two Okay. Yes. Header, footer, sidebar, component. Or... I, I, I will send one HTML source code. Okay. okay. HTML is there. You have to divide it. Then you can understand how component will work in this theme conversion. You have to uh, you have to learn right. Theming yes. conversion because the HTML source code will be there. And then in the real case scenario, the whatever the HTML developer will put you the uh, HTML templates. Okay. You have to convert this in the source code to React code. Then you have to know how component will work. Okay. Nested component you have to create. Okay. Yes. Now I'm going to share uh, my screen. I have so there is less time is there. Are you able to see my screen? Please confirm. Yes. Now. This is the concept of state and props. Okay. This is very vital and this is very important in React project. So the I will spend two or two to two days more in the state and props. Okay. Just introduce the state and props today. And tomorrow we are going to hands on. Okay. For the state and props. So you can see, right? Uh, you can see my skin, right? Yes. So what is state? And what is prop? Okay, so state is called an object of any React application. So every class you have to create, right? Like app class, like main class. It means not your functional component. Whenever you place class-based component, that time you have to create some class, right? Class app. So whenever you create one class, its state automatically created. Okay. State is there. You can understand. You can see my picture. This one, the component. Every component has its own state. Okay. Have you understood the diagram? And this is component, right? Your home, your main, your contact us. So every component has its own state and own and props. Props means uh, some outside. Uh, I mean, I have two components, okay, main and app. So main JS ka, agar mujhe kuch data chahiye, so I can pass this data from main JS to app JS through props. So props helps to buy, uh, gather the data from other component to desired component. So component under state is default, state is there. And state is called an object, like normal JavaScript object. You create the object and add anything you can assign the state. Okay. And prop prop is called an argument that's passed into the React component. Means I have added main component, I have added app component. So from the app component to main component or main component to app component, if I want to send some data pass some data so it's called attribute add some attribute assign the value and then pass 
it will automatically pass okay so is it clear up to that second prop up to this way whatever i can discuss do you have any questions of for, for that hello 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 have you any questions props behave like a properties like props use it as like a properties okay html property normal html property the property name can be anything as you whatever you want you can add in the property name okay this is custom props custom property inside the property you have to assign some value this value you can get inside the next component so props is a global property you if you assign any value inside the prop the props automatically updated in the next component level okay so get the value from there and this value means basically it used to pass the data from one component to another component and every component ka ek state hota hai jo state hum log function component mein state directly nahi hota uske liye react has introduced some hooks that i will teach later but up to that you can understood every component has its own state and props helps to gather some data from one component to another component and this data we can bind inside the component okay is that clear to everybody okay yes sir so uh, tomorrow we can do first i have sent to the class i will send some source code normal html source code you have to split into the react component multiple react component right whatever i taught that header footer side map okay sir hmm then your jsx and component building block these two concept will be very much clear over there and state then we will go some hands on on the state and props okay how state and props is work in the real case scenario so uh, jsx and component level you can understand uh, with, with that uh, assignment okay so i will send it just divided the html source code into multiple react components so this is the conversion means html uh, the ux has provide in the project whenever you work so ux guys only provide the html source code you have to separate into multiple components in the react is that clear or is there any questions till now okay okay uh koshik i suppose i can stop the recording yes yes, yes. you can stop it's done yeah so actually we can drop off the meeting right yes 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 okay thank you everyone thank you koshik yes yes so thank guys you. see you tomorrow yes, yes. just if you have some questions or you can write in the group and we can discuss about there okay okay sir hmm. uh, okay yeah you can stop the presentation yes sure thank you everyone bye yeah. thank bye. you bye bye thank you. So she can I share my screen? Yes, share your screen. Oh no no, do anything. In the it's recording is there, so unnecessary will come in the other meeting. Okay, we can do that. <laughs>